This is question number four. We're told the line L1 has equation 4x plus 2y minus 3 is equal to 0. In part A for two marks, we're asked to find the gradient of L1. I'm just going to rearrange this into the form y is equal to mx plus c. So I'll have 2y subtracting the 4x from both sides and adding the 3. We will have now 2y is equal to minus 4x plus 3. Dividing both sides by the 2, we'll have minus 2x plus 3 over 2. We can see from this the value of m is going to be equal to minus 2. So the gradient of this line is minus 2. We're now told the line L2 is perpendicular to L1 and passes through the point 2 comma 5. In part b for 3 marks we need to find the equation of L2 in the form y is equal to mx plus c where m and c are constants. We can write down that m1 multiplied by m2 will be equal to minus 1 if perpendicular. We can see that m1, the gradient of L1, is minus 2. So m1 is equal to minus 2. Therefore, m2, which is going to be the gradient of a perpendicular, m2 will be the negative reciprocal, which will be positive 1 half. For the equation of a straight line, all we need is a gradient and a point that it goes through. I'm going to use y minus y1 is equal to m multiplied by x minus x1. So subbing this in, we will have y minus 5 is equal to 1 half, then we'll have x minus 2. I'm going to expand the brackets on the right. y minus 5 will be equal to 1 half x minus 1. And adding 5 to both sides, y will be equal to 1 half x plus 4. So the final answer in the form y is equal to mx plus c is y is equal to 1 half x plus 4.